my first question is for Dave. Okay. Um, how was Rob as a director? What um, what was maybe some of the things that he asked you to do? Well, it, it was me also asking him, can I do this? Can I do that? But then also, he was asking me like, I mean, one day he asked me, you have to kill somebody today? And I was like, of course, I've been waiting for that. So yeah, it was. It's it, he's he's a really good director. Mm -hmm. And how did it feel to actually have that on screen, having to like pretend to kill someone on screen? It was really fun, but then like I got sweaty and I got my workout, so I just I liked it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, my next question is for Tyler. So, uh, we're talking about on-screen killings. Um, did you have a particular favorite of uh, all the uh, people that you did in in this movie? Yeah. I'd have to say the most intense is when I get my suit back in the truck stop. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Have you seen it? Yes, I saw it last night. Pretty intense. That was, that was probably my favorite as well. Yeah. Yeah, that was a lot of fun working with Ken. Mm -hmm. He came in and he said, okay, let's go for it. And... Uh, we went for it. Definitely. Tore the bathroom stall up. <laughs> Two equal sized, very, very evenly matched. It yes. Good. It was a lot of fun. That's great. After about the 10th take, it wasn't getting to be too much fun, but uh, it was a lot of fun getting that one. Right. So you say the 10 takes for that one scene alone. Yeah. Well, I mean, you're doing it at different angles and different camera angles and, and things like that, and it's uh, to get the different shots on it. Mm -hmm. So there's pickup shots and close-up shots. When you have so many um, murder sequences with so many different characters and all, and all of these characters screaming their lives out, um, how do you go home and, and or how do you keep your sanity in between takes when you've got people screaming in your face all the time? It, you know, it's not usually too bad, except for uh, Scout got a little too close on our first day and screamed right in my ear, and that one was, uh, that one woke me up. Mm -hmm. But uh, other than that, you know, you get used to it. Mm -hmm. Once you got that mask on and that knife in your hands, you got a job to do, and you want them to scream. Yeah. Definitely. Um, did you guys, uh, actually this is for Dave. Okay. Um, did Rob ask you to do a lot of ad-libbing, just kind of making things up on the spot? Well, it was, yeah, but mostly when I was like uh, with Malcolm McDowell, one time he was like, okay, here's the basis of your lines, and then after that, just keep on going until I say cut. And me and Malcolm McDowell, we were kept on going, thinking of ideas, so, mm -hmm. yeah, it was cool. And could you talk about a little bit more about working with Malcolm? I mean, did you guys keep talking and joking after the camera cut, or...? Yeah, and sometimes, like, then scene was so intense, like, he was yelling at me and I was yelling at him, or he was like, calm down, and I was like, I can't calm down. Um, and sometimes we would just sit there and kind of like catch our breaths and then, and then just keep on going. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, did, uh, was there any advice that Malcolm passed along to you as a young actor, he being so experienced and you're so young? Um, I actually didn't really give that much advice. There's one thing I do remember when uh, Malcolm and Sherry, it was so funny, they were discussing about a movie, what color a pen was, they were betting on it. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, he's just a really nice guy. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Um, my last question is for uh, you, Tyler. Um, did you, what sort of, of your own uh, physical presence did you try and bring to uh, Michael Myers? Well, I mean, I, I dissected the character to see what I wanted to do. I definitely wanted to morph um, Michael Myers from the sanitarium into the Michael Myers that people know and have come to love. So I had to figure out how I was going to do that with the, and, and the only way I could do it was with body movement and with my eyes. So I had to figure out the physicality that I wanted to bring to it and uh, just reflect on some things and, and uh, hopefully people will think that it was brought to life very well. Right. All right. Well, thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you.